So as you can see, I decided to upgrade and replace the John Queer. This is a 2020 Husqvarna Z48. 48 stands for the width of the deck. It's a 48 inch deck. It's got a Kawasaki 22 horsepower engine in it. You can cut from one and a half inches up to four and a half here with the adjustment down below. Um, other than that, it's got some, some nice cup holders, very comfortable seat. I can't really give an honest review yet because I've only used it 1.3 hours. That's all the machine has on it. It's basically cut my mowing time in half, if not more. It used to take me right around three hours, 3.25 hours to mow my two and a half, three acres that I mow here. And um, so far, I've loved it. I found a couple things I don't like that I didn't really notice. Uh, when I drove it around the um, the shop that I bought it from. But uh, that is here nor there. I still really am happy with this purchase thus far after owning it 1.3 hours. With all that being said, let's walk around. It's got the uh, heavy duty fabricated deck. It's not a stamped deck. Pretty uh, good size welds on there. These are air um, inflated tires in the front. Um, Let's see, yeah, 48 inch deck wide. It just fits in the shed there, as you can see from me pulling it out. Um, here's the adjustment here on how you uh, adjust the deck. This is where you engage your, your mower. It just simply pulls up. Once these are pulled in tight, basically like your safety levers or neutral, you have your choke right here, your key ignition, your throttle, gas gasoline uh, fuel port here's the kawasaki 22 horsepower gasoline engine in all its glory here's the nice painted rops pretty good uh, tread on these tires i haven't left that many ruts i'm new to zero turns to be honest with you i've been using one for my summer job around the complex there that i um, maintain and i fell in love and that's why I've pretty much decided to upgrade just because it's more efficient and uh, it's a time saver. And with all the stuff that I do, I definitely needed to save some time. Why did I choose Husqvarna? To be honest with you, I've never had an issue with my weed eater or chainsaw in almost five years that I've owned them. And I'm really happy with the quality level of their products. Uh, I wouldn't compare them you know, side by side to Kubota, but as far as the what they think of in engineering and the construction of their product, it's it's pretty similar. Um, let's see, let's uh, let's go over here and show you what I thought was pretty cool. So you got one compartment here for storage with a hole in case it rains, it'll drain. A lot of people don't think about that when you wash off your machine. A lot of those cup holders will hold water, and then how do you get it out, right? soak it up with rags and it can be just a tedious process this cup holder here has a drain port as well the only one that uh oh even this cell phone holder has a little drain port here you could sit your cell phone right inside of this here is your uh, hour meter uh, like i said i haven't ran this thing enough to give a full honest review on it i'll put the link to the uh business the shop that i bought it from uh, first quality power place here where I live and like I said, I'll put a link to their website and maybe their address Dan the owner and I have been friends for the last about three four years I bought my chainsaw and my weed eater from him and uh, We worked kind of a deal out on this machine one thing to note about Husqvarna is that they do offer a military discount So I was able to save 10% on this mower. I qualified for the 0% interest over four years so um, I picked this mower up right around $5,000 and um, Dan also is going to help me with the firewood business. He bought 10 bundles from me and is going to put them um, at, his, at his store there. So that is good too. So that will be my third location. But uh, I'm pretty excited, pretty happy. Uh, like I said, I've already mowed so I was going to uh, not do a video on it yet until I actually had some hours in it. But I was pretty excited. A lot of people have been telling me to upgrade, and um, I'm glad I did. So here it is, all its glory, my new Husqvarna Z448. And I will uh, 
in the future be doing you know the service videos on this and as I find things that I don't like or like about it I will uh, keep you guys updated so just a short video this weekend I got a lot going on and honestly I just wanted to relax so thanks for watching make something great happen get outside it's a beautiful weekend and uh, enjoy some sunshine and we'll see you on the next video